4,000. Hey guys, today is Saturday and we are headed to the outlets. We're going to the West Elm outlet and then we're also going to Target. So I figured I'll just take you guys with us to run our errands and then we'll see what else we get into. We were going to go to Ikea, so we'll see if we have time to go there. And we're going to first make a stop. Just stop it. to the West Elm outlet and now we're gonna check out some of the stuff that they got. We're looking for like, what do you call that? Like a tree, like a coat rack that they have in the, in the main store, but they use it as like, for like, um, what do you call it? They use it for towels and stuff like that. That's what we're looking for. It looked really cute the way they had it in the store. So hopefully they have it here. They had a couple last week and they said they'd never get them. And we're gonna see, oh, it looks like I got some new stuff. Trying to find it, so this set is the one that matches the furniture that we have coming the bed and the set that we want we weren't even going to get this one but because it was here and it's a good price it's like thirteen hundred dollars and you get 40 percent well we're going to go ahead and get it but then it has this huge nick over here in the corner and it's pretty significant so we're not gonna get this one all right guys so we just left the outlet and we didn't find a lot of stuff that we were looking for <laughs> we didn't find a lot of stuff that we were looking for but we did get um one thing that we were looking for the curtain rod that has the extra piece for the shears so anyway we're gonna get this and then we might go to the restoration hardware outlet um we'll see but we still have to make um stops at ikea and target so we just pulled up the restoration hardware outlet this is actually my first time going in here so let's see what we find i'm already addicted to west down so let's feed the cravings all right so i found this piece and i thought it'd be really cool for the studio closet room it's exactly the kind of thing i'm looking for as far as an island and then put another one behind it so it could be really perfect and I want, this is the kind of like jewelry display I want. I can see my pieces and shop my jewelry and then open the drawers and have exactly what I'm looking for. So this is priced at $13.90 at the outlet price. This is over $2,000 for the full price, the retail price. And they say you're saving 958 bucks, which they should be embarrassed about because the drawers do not even open comfortably. They don't even open smoothly. So I'm really disappointed. This is something that's like $1,400 and the drawers don't even open properly. Hey guys, we just got to Ikea, so now we're gonna see what they have. We're just gonna um, get some shears. I need some shears for the curtains, and then we'll see what else they have. I've been trying to get a squeegee from Ikea for I don't even know how long, because I need a squeegee to clean the glass in the shower, because the shower is pretty much all encased in glass, and my giant mirror in the studio room, so we'll see. <laughs> places but we were just walking past this lady and she told us to try the olive oil cake at Barcelona which I like Barcelona but I've never had the dessert and then Bar Taco behind us back here they have churro it was in the shop <laughs> <laughs> and then Bar Taco behind us has like that, the, the Bar Taco <laughs> and then Bar Taco behind us they have churros with like chocolate dipping sauce so I was like maybe that we're again next to Beetle Cat so I'm like okay maybe we should go to Beetle Cat I don't know so we're trying to figure out I just want like just a little something you know Yo, all right, all right, let's try it. <laughs> she recommended olive oil cake. Well, you're walking the wrong way. Barcelona's right here. She, rec <laughs> she recommended olive oil cake. All right, well, let's, let's try this. I'm two drinks in, y'all. <laughs> My tolerance is kind of low. <laughs> olive oil cake. All right, you want to try it? 
<laughs> We're gonna try it. Olive oil cake. Right. All right. All right. Well, if we can even get in, because look at the line. Look, show them the line. Oh, I don't know. Oh, maybe right. we can go. I don't know. This place is too crowded, man. I'm out of here. Good morning, you guys. So it's actually almost the afternoon. It's a little before 11:30. Today's Friday, and I am headed out to run some errands. So I figured I would take you guys with me. Today I have to run to the Alice and Olivia store and I'm going to pick up some new stuff. They have some new pieces. I want to check them out and see what pieces I want to style for you guys and show you on the channel. And I picked up these glasses that I'm so excited about. I love these. I'm obsessed. These Gucci shades, not the ones I'm wearing, but these black ones. Let me just show you. So I picked up these Gucci shades. They're so cute. I love them. They're really, they're oversized. Not as big as the ones I'm wearing, but pretty oversized. Anyway, the case that the girl gave me is not even big enough to hold the glasses, which I'm bummed about because this is a nice purple case. I don't have one this color yet, and it doesn't even close. But I didn't realize that because she put it inside of the velvet, um, the satin pouch that comes inside. She put the whole case inside of that, so I didn't even realize. Anyway, I'm going to see if they have some cases that fit these glasses because Gucci cannot have made this case for these glasses. So anyway, I'm running out to do that. And oh, check out my braids. I didn't even tell you guys about my new hair. I got some new braids. They are very long. I'll show you guys the length in a second. I'm gonna show you my entire outfit. I'm just running errands. So I wanted to wear something comfortable, but of course cute in case I took like some photos. I didn't feel like wearing makeup today. So I'm just gonna wear these shades. And I think I'm having a good skin day though. My skin has been acting pretty good, but I do have one little thing happening right here. But overall I have pretty good skin, so I guess I shouldn't complain. And that's it. So let me show you guys what I'm wearing. And then I gotta get out the door. All right, you guys, so here's the outfit breakdown. I'm wearing this denim shirt from Target. I've had this for a long time. And then my shorts, these are actually sweat shorts. Had these for a little while, but I got them this summer. Love these, very comfortable. I wanted to wear like just sweatpants in general, but it's like 80 degrees, so I didn't want to burn up and die. <laughs> so I'm wearing these sweat shorts, and I'm always cold, so I'll be fine. And then I'm wearing my Chloe Test bag. I did a little half tuck with the shirt. So anyway, I'm just wearing my Chloe Test bag. And then these are my Sam Edelman like snake print platform sandals. I love these. And you guys always ask me about these, especially recently I styled them up with like a white baby doll dress. These are old, they are not available anymore, but I will link to something similar because Sam Edelman has been having a sale on some of their sandals. And some of them look pretty similar. It's a different vibe, but you can get a similar look, you know what I mean? So I'll just link to those. Hopefully they're still available. And then that's it. I'm wearing my Gucci shades. These are not available anymore, but they do have some that are similar. They just don't have the Gucci G's, you know what I mean? And then for fragrance, I'm gonna go with this Creed Love & White. I never reach for this, and I don't know why, because I really do love the way that it smells. So that's it. That's my outfit. Now let's go. Oh, and one more thing before I go. I almost forgot to say thank you to you guys. This morning, I woke up and I realized that I hit 30K on Instagram, and I am so happy about that. Thank you guys so much, because you guys have really been sharing and like reposting all of my photos on my content on Instagram. So thank you guys so much. And if you haven't been following me or you haven't checked out my Instagram page, I'll have all the links in the description box on all the platforms that you can find me on. All right, guys, let's go. Actually, one more thing before I go. I forgot to tell you how long my braids were. They're pretty, pretty long. Well, these are the longest braids I've ever had. I know like you seem way longer, but for me, this is the longest I've ever had. I really love them. The girl did it so neat. They're so beautiful. All right, for real, let's go this time. <laughs> okay. All right, you guys, we are really leaving right now, but I want to show you my mother's outfit. So let's talk about what you're wearing, girl. Oh, so I'm wearing this denim dress. I guess you'll link it below. <laughs> <laughs> or something similar. Um, the sunglasses are Gucci, um, you know, just a big circle. Um, I'm extremely coordinated today. So <laughs> I have uh, the uh, Gucci, it's, I forget, it's like a hobo style sort of bag with the leather handle. It's giving vintage vibes. Yeah, um, I prefer their vintage line actually. And then on down here I have on um, an ankle bracelet and these are the Gucci flip flops. Also, uh, I've had these for a very long time. I think they updated them some, mm -hmm. um, but they're still out there. Uh, so best thing about this dress, it's wrap, which is flattering for, you know, the curves. The curves. And then pockets. What? We love those. Love the pockets. So, okay, girl. All right. So All right. That's today's look. 
Perfume is Chanel Chance Tundra. So I think that's how you say it. Okay, cool. All right, guys, so we'll see you later because we gotta go. <laughs> So we just got to Buckhead Village and now we're walking to Alice and Olivia. And I'm gonna take you guys inside so you can see like what, what pieces I pick out. And you get a preview of their collection. Can you stay here while I'm finding a way? I can't fake it, you don't have to. When you call, I'll be there on a the late night. I try my best to put up a great fight. I know I'm wrong, you start to Please don't like tell me that you love. So we just left Alice and Olivia and I got some cute stuff that I'm going to show you guys in the upcoming video. I'm going to take some photos, but now I'm headed to get my eyebrows done and I'll just talk to you guys when I get there. Don't go saying it's the money. That ain't changed me, it changed everyone else. So I just left the brow place. I just got my brows done and my lip threaded. Usually I get wax, but today she just was moving quickly, which is fine. But when I can't take the pain and I want it to be quick, I just go ahead and get my lip waxed. Anyway, so I just found out earlier that I have to reshoot a video that I did that is sponsored, which I'm kind of bummed about because I got to do the entire video over. And I think it's gonna be a good thing because I think the first time I shot it, I was kind of like overthinking things. So I'm fine to do the reshoot. The thing is, I didn't want to work this weekend because me and Winston want to go out tonight. And I just want to chill this weekend, but I'm gonna to have to work and I actually have to do a lot more work than I thought. But I think we still gonna go out tonight. <laughs> anyway, so once I figure out my plan, then I'll, I'll update you guys. But yeah, so now I'm wearing the car, getting some gas, and then we're gonna head back home. I'm actually really hungry now. And I need to get some water because I didn't drink any all day. So I'll talk to you guys in a sec. I just came back in the house and I'm really hungry, but I'm actually about to run out again. I'm having some plantain crisps from Trader Joe's. These are really, really good. And then Winston made some hummus. It's a really nice combo. But you can also, like, if you don't want to make homemade hummus, you can get the one from Trader Joe's. But this one's banging. All right, guys, we got to go to the farmer's market. So I said I wanted to be in your vlog. <laughs> this is your segment. I ain't say I wanted a segment right now. We just got to the farmer's market. We got to pick up some stuff for dinner and for just for the, like vegetables and stuff for, in general. So we're going to go in here. But your girl dropped her hair on the floor. <laughs> my bad, y'all. I told you I got a new look because I forgot my hair in the park. It's the wall, the love we gave. I can't take it away. You can't take it away. You go on the love we gave, we gave. You can't take it away. I can't take Are you recording? Yes. Can we real quick? Real quick? Turn the camera that way? This no, way? no, 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 way. Get our hands in it. Ready? Do it. He's got them gold diggers. <laughs> I like to call him more, um, I'm more like an investor. <laughs> she gon' still be the same. If you ever wanted, I'm the same OG. If you ever wanted, I'm the same old me. If you ever wanted, you can still call me. It's all doing it in screen. Can I have a medium, um, caramel, ice caramel latte? Can I have a medium ice caramel latte? With oat milk. With oat, with oat milk? Thank you. Okay, it say iced. Now, it says iced. This is the third time I asked him iced and I'll see what comes out. What you gotta say? Got nothing to say. <laughs> Mark is in DR. Oh, he is? Mm -hmm. Like for just vacation or something's happening? Vacation. 
him, his girl, her sister, and her husband. So he did a couple trip, man. He tells us. It's not funny. Because he wasn't invited. It's, it's not funny. <laughs> then I'm seeing mad people that we know was at the Kanye thing. Ain't nobody call us and tell us. <laughs> Shit, a lot of you knew it. Yeah, shit is in everybody's stories. Come on. We ain't got no friends, y'all. Did you just fly? Y'all yeah, are friends. The Park Avenue. What is it? The PA crew? PA Queens, y'all have to tell me. I heard one like name for us, and I feel like we need to come up with something. Was the PA Queens? Oh my gosh, I can't even remember it. Let me know in the comments. Uh, we need a name for our our group. The Gold Diggers. <laughs> G O A L S. Oh, Gold Diggers. Okay, <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> the Gold Diggers. I, you know, I always want a T-shirt like that. Appreciate you, bro. How we go? Perfect. There you go. So I got an ice bucket and it finally got it right. Twice. I mean, I come to this. I've been to this one like maybe a handful of times. And every time I come, they mess up my drink. They I ask for ice, they give me hot. <sighs> anyway, I'm happy. So since my plans have changed, I'm just gonna eat and then relax a little bit and then get to cleaning. I'm eating some Estevich fish and a little bit of fried bread fruit. Love for your sister, your little brother might still be the same. This shit gon' still be Hi guys, we are back in the car. I feel like I just left you guys in the car. But I just finished filming a couple of videos and I really wanted to come outside. I haven't been outside all day. But I might have I might regret that now because it's like 80,000 degrees out here. This is the part of the summer I really don't like. I don't like when it's hot this hot. Anyway, we are just running out because your man over here. He's cutting his hair. Yep, yep, yep. How you feel about that? You're talking to me or the viewers. I'm talking to you. I don't feel too good about it. Tell him about your head journey. It was a dark and stormy night. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it wasn't even a journey, you guys. His hair grows back in like three seconds. That's how I don't understand. He's when he would have when he has like a low haircut, he'll go for a haircut and like three days later he'll need a haircut. It grows so fast, like it's ridiculous. So I don't know why he's like reluctant about it, but he really likes it. So and I think it looks good, you know? What? I, love my hair, so. I know it looks really good, but I just know how fast it's gonna go back. That's why to me it's like not a big deal. And he knows too because he cut his hair once before and it grew back so fast. Like, it took a couple years to get like right here, but it's too dirty. I'm working too much like with the construction, and it's like I'm always dealing with sheetrock and it's in the way. And now this little piece right here is like hanging in front of my hair, so I gotta pin it up with this little pin. <laughs> and it's, it's just too it, much to deal yeah, with. it's too much to deal with. And then like. And it's really hot. It's hot, summertime, working out, sweat, getting in your, holding your hair and all that. It's too much. So I'm gonna just cut it and then start over from scratch. So like another two years, it'll be back. When you gonna start back immediately? Immediately. Oh, okay. Yeah, so anyway, next time you guys see him, he'll probably, he'll probably grow back. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we headed to the barbershop and then, um, I don't know if we're going anywhere else after that. Oh, we gotta go to the post office because we got some closet sale orders. We gotta drop those off. And then, um, and then I guess we're going to the barbershop. I don't know which one we're going to first, but I'll just talk to you guys when we get to wherever we're going next. And I really want to go pick up some, like, popsicles, some ices or something, because I just really been wanting those. And I wish they had, like, a icy man out here, because they make the best, like, ices. I wish I could have, like, a, like a, at a pizza shop, you know, like, the Italian ice or something like that. But they don't have anything like that around here, so I'll just have to go get me, like, a, I don't know, something from, what's the one that I like? The one that you like, we both like in green. 
It's like all natural, like it's made out of fruit juice or something like that. No, from the regular supermarket. I don't know the name of it though, but I just like it. Anyway, well, okay, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, if we go to the store or something, I'll show you guys which one it is. And then I'm ready to go home, really. I mean, I wanted to come outside, but I'm ready to get back in the house because my mother made some soup and I'm really hungry. And that joint is busting, so. Yeah, I tasted it like I had some real quick before I went out. Yeah, later. You want to turn around? Dun, dun, dun. Coming down to the moment. <laughs> this is the clip. This is the hair page. You want to take it down now? Mm hmm. Goodbye, my friend. Goodbye, my friend. How that song go? Goodbye, my friend. Never to see you again. We're in the barbershop, but he's having second thoughts. No, I have a second thought. I'm looking at you just before I turn his camera on. He just said he's having second thoughts. I hate it. <laughs> It looks like a crown. Huh? It looks like a crown. Niggas just take that little swag. I got my. Thank God that I'm blessed in my cup overflow. Thank God that I'm this and I ain't tripping on no hoe. Thank God I'm the shit and I knew that from the door. Ain't need no nigga to let me know. Getting money since the baby. Shout out to niggas over there on pole. Hell no, nah, the streets ain't raised me, but I always check the score. Change everybody, you know. That's what the money do. She used to say she best friend, she actin' funny too Call out my nigga special ed, they keepin' dummies too You know every pocket clock out at a ghillie suit She used to go to Chick-fil-A to get the chicken soup She used to love the lemonade with a splash of juice I used to love her Like a new man Where you starting back at one <laughs> Alright guys, so we're about to go into the West Ham outlet. They have that stand that we're looking for, the towel stand. Well, the cold rack that we're using as a towel stand. It was really cute like that. We're going to check that out. I want to see if they have any like trash cans for the bathroom. I didn't see any like that last time. I'm going to check out the chairs because I really need a chair for the studio room. And just see what else they have. I mean, last time we were here, I didn't see a ton of stuff that I wanted. But, you know, that's why you got to come frequently. So let's just go see what they got. Well, West Ham was a uh, fail today. They did have a really nice mirror though. But we don't need that mirror right now. And honestly, I don't even know where we put it at the moment. So we skipped it. But they always have a good rotation of things. So we'll just be back again. And now we are... I gotta go to the dollar store because I've been cleaning the windows in the house. And I need a hard toothbrush to get like in those little nooks and crannies. And then later today, we're going to Trader Joe's. Probably like after this though. Get money, you can't spend the friends you make, huh? It make me laugh, they tell me what I am, I ain't. Where the cash at? Alright guys, we just did the first outfit, now we're gonna do the second one. I have a white dress and then a black dress. Um, I try not to like take too many things when we go on photo shoots because sometimes I get a little caught up in trying to, you know, I forget pieces and all that or whatever. So anyway, we're gonna do these two outfits and then what's the things we'll be done by 12, so that'll be good because I got a meeting at one o'clock. So on to the next location. And I know you, the old you, that's what I'm used to seeing. I like the growth too. Don't act strange around me. I so we finished all three outfits and now we're going to Whole Foods. We want some salads for lunch. So we over here by Pond City Market and there's a Whole Foods right next to it. So let's go. 
I can only get out your way and let you do what you want to. So we're in Whole Foods. We were supposed to come in here, get chicken cutlets, and get home because I have a meeting at 1 o'clock. And then I saw these popsicles. This is 100% real juice. I never tried these before. But we since we're trying to eat healthy, I wanted to get... I like popsicles and I really wanted one right now. And we got to go back home, so I didn't want to put them in the car, like in the trunk. Anyway, now he getting oxtail. Yo. We in Whole Foods, and Whole Foods oxtails are cheaper than the farmer's market. They're cheaper than... That's, I guess that's the only other place I got. <laughs> <laughs> Stick around, who gon' teach me a lesson? Who gon' be my weakness? Who gon' be a blessing? Can you be my muse? I need a secret weapon. Yeah, yeah. Can you keep All right, so we're back in the car. We went to Whole Foods, picked up some chicken for our salad for when we get home. And they had like a lot of meat on sale, like once I got oxtails. I switched to my uh, my iPhone, so hopefully the footage is fine. But I picked up some popsicles, and I thought. I mean, they're popsicles. We paid $13 for the popsicles, and I didn't even realize that until we left. We saved money on the meat, and then we spent $20 on popsicles. What did I say before we go to Whole Foods, before we went? That, that's I, why you don't like Whole Foods. I don't like Whole Foods. Because it is expensive, but... It's, it's, no, it's not, it's not expensive. It's, it's taking advantage of these. To get, um, to get, like, healthy food. No, it's not even... It's the same food. It's the same shit. Same farms as Sprouts, as Kroger. And then they jack the price up. Fuck. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot I can't curse my channel. But today's photo shoot was a success and it was really good and went fast, so that was good. Alright, I'll talk to you guys in a sec. Alright guys, I am back in the house. I just finished my meeting. I just changed my clothes and I'm about to wash my face and have something to eat. I'm a, I'm still very hot <laughs> from being outside, but yeah, my meeting went really well and I have to get to planning some content for the rest of the week. I really need to clean up the studio. I'm not even gonna show you guys, but it's a real mess because between the closet sale, filming videos, and just getting reorganized, I have made a mess again. <laughs> so anyway, I am going to just get comfortable and then I'm gonna get back to get myself together because Mondays are planning days. In the mornings, Winston and I have our weekly meetings on Mondays. And then, um, you know, I plan out my content and everything like that. And then I film on Tuesday, so I prepare for the next day. So, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to vlog again anymore today. So, I'll pick up the camera if something happens. Or I'll see you guys tomorrow. In every song, I ask the same question. Who going to stick around? Who going to teach me a lesson? Who going to be my weakness? Who going to be my blessing? Can you be my muse? Can you be my secret weapon? Yeah, yeah. And I every song, I ask the same question. Who going to stick around? Who going to teach me a lesson? Who gon' be my weakness? Who gon' be a blessing?